Hey, what is going on guys? I am the Explosive Gamer and welcome to my video for my first kill of Crota. I know it's a little bit after the Dark Below came out, but think of it, I only got the Dark Below just, I think, after Christmas or before Christmas. I don't remember. Anyway, I didn't get it on release. I probably would have played the raid a little bit earlier if I got it on release, but then again, if I, I would have played it after Vault of Glass, I'm confused with myself. Anyway. This raid is fun, very, very easy for most of it. It is, the lamps are probably, or the, uh, the, the, it's either the lamps are, are probably my least favorite part of the raid. And then the death slinger is, is okay. Like, you know, I think the lamps are my least favorite part of the raid because really all they're doing is running and then you're standing and waiting while you kill an ogre and then you run across a bridge. It's easy. Most of the raid is easy. I can I can say that. I've been able to pretty much solo the lamps up until where I'm crossing to go to do uh, to get to the bridge checkpoint. I could pretty much solo the lamps from there. But when I got to that part, I don't know why, but every time the ogre would get glitched and then teleport and then kill me in one shot. It would have been cool to solo that part, but I didn't get to. Anyway, this uh, is my first run. This is my first kill of Crota that you're watching here. This is my using my level 30 Titan. I was 31, now I'm back to 30 because I changed up some gear a little bit. I'm using the Badger CCL Scout Rifle and the Vault of Glass Sniper Rifle, the Paradis Revenge, and I'm actually using the Dragon's Breath because it's the only launcher I had and it still did damage to Crota and help, help him get down on his one knee. But it, it, it's pretty much useless. I only used it once in the entire raid, and I think once or twice in the entire uh, Crota kill, and it, it's not really useful at all. It looks cool though. Then I'm keeping it because I want all the exotics. Uh, but you know what? The Crota kill is really cool. Um, Crota himself looks cool. I haven't done the sword yet. Now that I'm thinking about it, I haven't done the sword yet, so I don't know. But I've only run this twice as of now. And I and actually ran it with level 27 Warlock. I did the lamps and the bridge with that, but really, but because I was level 27, I didn't get anything. I couldn't do anything because all of the enemies were question marks to me. So I couldn't do any damage to them no matter what I used. So at the end of the bridge with my level 27, I, ha I pretty much stayed dead the entire time and crossed the bridge after they completed the checkpoint. I actually got the chest armor for the Warlock on that time slot, brought me up to level 29, I'm pretty sure, after I upgraded it a little bit. I'm still working on it. I'm going to be level 30 probably by the end of the week, or yeah, to the end of the weekend. No, end of the week, yeah, I'm going to say end of the week. Uh, so I, now I can do Nightfall with that character, and I can do the all of the, all of the um, Heroic, so that'll be sweet. I'll be able to do that and get twice as many strange coins and twice the chance of getting good stuff in the nightfall that'll be fun and also get twice the amount of uh, raid runs in too because i can do now because it's level 29 almost level 30 i can do crota i can do hard vault of glass and i can do normal vault of glass obviously so that's three extra crota run, or three extra runs i can do and then hopefully i'll be able to get hit level 32 almost or level at least, at least late level 31 with my titan so i can i can do quota hard mode and try that out i want to be getting into the raid mo the raid scene more because i've only really done the raids way after they were released i did uh vault of glass like just before christmas as you saw that video i did crota today yes it's a couple days ago and then i did vault of glass hard mode this around the same time so i'm hoping to get uh crota hard mode done and then move on to whatever house of wolves dlc so i can get on to that and then do that when it comes out instead of waiting months after it comes out to do that anyway guys hope you enjoyed i'll leave you with my crota kill at the end of this i got the hunger of crota launcher it's really cool anyway hope you enjoyed and i'll see you on the next one peace out Thank <laughs> you.
Thank you.